Good afternoon. I'm Assistant Chief Annie Smith of the Crimes Against Persons Division. I'm here to provide you with information on the arrest of 35-year-old Robert Brian Luke. Mr. Luke was arrested last night on charges of capital sexual battery where the victim was under the age of 12 and other sex-related crimes. Mr. Luke is a teacher at Lakeshore Middle School. He's also a youth soccer coach, a former swim coach, and a former substitute teacher at Southside Middle School. In order to protect the identity of the victim, I'm not able to tell you how the suspect and the victim were acquainted. Mr. Luke had been the subject of a previous allegation back in September of 2007 while he was working as a substitute teacher at Southside Middle School. There was not enough evidence at that time for an arrest. As you know, we take these cases very seriously, and these cases are also very complicated when dealing with crimes against children. This is an active and ongoing investigation, and anyone who has any information that might help us is encouraged to call 630-0500 or call the Sex Crimes Unit directly at 630-2168. I will take questions, but keep in mind that this case involves the sexual assault of a child. It's also an active case, and so a lot of the details I, I can't disclose. you believe that there's the potential for other victims? Um, we don't know, um, but being that he is a school teacher and has had contact with children, um, in his capacity as a teacher and as a coach, we just don't know at this time. The first time you heard about him, or the first allegation came September of 2007? Yes. And the victim in this case was not that person, it's a different they person. They are two separate victims, that's correct. Can you give us the gender of the victim? No. What's the time frame for this arrest that this uh, act allegedly occurred? Is the, what, the January through April that's on here? The, as soon as we were made aware of the allegation, the investigation uh, immediately took place and we made an arrest the next day. But you can't tell us when this act may have occurred or over what period act or acts occurred? It was over uh, several months. Um, I can't disclose the exact time frame. Really any, and the reason why I can't d discuss the, the gender of the victim, um, you know, we really want to protect the identity of this child and Anything that would lead to the identity of that victim, I'm, I'm not going to But the time period occurred during this year, during this January to April? That's yes, it occurred office. during this, this year. Yes. Okay. Can you tell us how the allegation surfaced? The child disclosed to um, the parent, and the parent reported. Last question, please. The parent reported to the, to the sheriff's office. This, is this the guardian, guardian or legal custody? Since her dad, so I'm having a hard time. Was, this was his or her parent? The, the was parent of the victim? Yes. That's how we received the information with the complaint. So, just to be clear, when we say this, this happened more than once, possibly over January to April? So yes, and there are, there are multiple uh, charges against this individual as related to this victim. And Thank you, Chief. Do you want people to call if they have? Absolutely. Absolutely. So I mean, we can say may, he may have other, he may have. I, you may know, we honestly people. don't know. Uh, but you have an individual who has access to children on a daily basis and outside of his regular job is a coach. So that person has interaction with young children all the time. So given that is the case and the type of crime that this is, you know, we just don't know. So. To, in order to err on the side of caution, we want people, this is a good opportunity for, for parents to talk to their kids about things like this. And it may be not even related to this particular teacher, but parents should to always talk to their kids so that they know what's going on. Are you still working with the school to see if there were any other potential victims? Where we are. We work? have been and, and will continuously have contact with the school board about, about this individual and, and this case, and any other cases if they come up. Thank you, Chief. 